Race 3 is a four and a half furlong thoroughbred claiming event for fillies and mares three and up. Offering one dollar pick three wagering, you have seven minutes in which to invest. The post parade is led by number one after sundown. One of a pair owned and trained by Angie Aquino, Eric Garcia is the rider. Next out is number three, JC, owned and trained by Troy Dial and ridden by Efren Hernandez. Four, paid in gold, owned by... David and John Hugsma and Robert van der Dusen, trained by Sergio Morphine, ridden by Cesar Ortega. Morphine also trains number five Dancing Crane for David and Jorge Landeros. Edgar Pieris is in the aisles. Six, Schwer Arbiter, owned and trained by Aquino, Adrian Escobedo up. And here is number two, Rock and Roll Song, on the track, making his way past the finish line, beneath Ricardo Ramirez. Trainer Adan Farias shares in the ownership with David Shaddick, Earl Silvia, and Jorge Padilla. Two for number two, Rock and Roll Song. All set. Racing! Rock and Roll Song was off poorly. Dancing Crane gets a flyer, leads early from JC in the yellow blinkers, who's flanked by Paid in Golden after sundown, then Schwer Arbiter outside Rock and Roll Song. They're covered by four lengths, Dancing Crane in front by one, from after sundown coming through along the inside second. Then comes JC, Rock and Roll Song out to the three path, splitting horses. On his outside as they make the turn is Paid in Gold, and back at the rear, Schwer Arbiter, circling the 3 16th pole and Dancing Crane by two lengths to after sundown, followed by Rock and Roll Song and paid in gold is out deep. Into the stretch comes Dancing Crane by a length and a half after sundown with plenty of room to threaten along the rail. Rock and Roll Song is joining in with paid in gold. It's Rock and Roll Song, paid in gold. Paid in gold doing a touch the better. Paid in gold edging Rock and Roll Song. Dan Ricardo Ramirez has a riding double. As the result goes official on race three.